I left Manila Saturday night and it was such a trip. It was raining so hard and I couldn't book anything so I had to walk in the intense rain with my heavy luggage. I was scared I'd miss the only bus of the night but I was so lucky because there wasn't any traffic so I made it just on time. I was very drenched though. We left at around 9.30pm and when I woke up, we were already in the mountains. I am finally in Sagada. It took me so much energy to get to go here. I am so tired already. This is where I'm staying. It's very far from a lot of places. <laughs> this is my little room. They got a garden view out here. Then I have my own bathroom. <laughs> this is my pants that got wet last night. <laughs> I've freshened up and I'm ready to go, but I think it's gonna rain. I hope it doesn't. I'm so scared. But okay, I'll bring my. I have been praying for good weather for the past few weeks because apparently there's a storm coming in, like two storms. And if that happened within. The days that I booked, I wouldn't push through. But now that I'm finally here, I hope it, the weather stays okay. It's starting to rain. hasn't stopped and I'm trying to look for this restaurant that I want to eat in but it hasn't stopped raining <laughs> so nice to walk though 
I wish it would stop raining though. Look. It's getting dark and the restaurant that I wanted to have dinner in is currently closed because the staff went to the mass. So now I'm just gonna go walk back home. I don't even know if I can get if I can still get dinner. Huh. There's no tricycles here. Very rare jeepneys too. So I have no choice but to walk. It's gonna be a 30 minute walk from here to my place. Oh my gosh. I've been walking so much. I enjoy it. I'm just a little bit scared. <laughs> Want to get dark. No electricity, but I'm trying to keep myself warm. about to head out I'm joining a group tour which was in my plan I originally just planned to see Marlboro and Blue Soil Hills but I haven't seen the falls here Bomodok Falls so I'm like yeah maybe we should try that I'm going on a group tour with a bunch of people that I don't know they're also I think solo travelers and a bunch of couples because here you can't DIY like treks and hikes you have to hire a tourist guide and for every tourist guide they can guide up to seven people so they have a fixed rate and if you're not seven you still have to pay the whole thing so the tourism office groups people together I don't know why I didn't pack lighter shoes. I mean, I did, but I don't want to ruin my new ones because <laughs> I just bought it. So I'm gonna hike with my Dr. Martens. Let's see if I'm gonna survive. It. This is the fit. It's real.
I love how there's always a salad and dessert stuff here. Every time I'm away, one of the things that I really enjoy is when I get to do nothing.